Hey, Chris Greenman, Profile Network. We're here with Frank Thomas, and I'm excited for lots of reasons. Uh, number one, I admired you when you played uh, baseball. You're one of those guys that are fun to watch because they always go when you hit it, it always went over the fence, and so that's always nice to watch in baseball. But uh, these days, you're doing like a little different kind of stuff, huh? You're involved with music, and we're here at a very nice studio. Well, music, something I've been involved with for now 14 years straight. Uh, I just kept it really on. Really on down low because uh, I didn't want to interfere with my baseball career. And once you start doing too many things at one time, people, you know, this doesn't sit well with some people. So uh, it's been something that I've had my own studio twice. Um, I have one big studio in downtown Chicago for eight years. Um, and I, I built my home studio here in Chicago. I mean, excuse me, here in Las Vegas. So uh, I've been involved with this for a long time now. So yeah, who have you produced so far? That um, you might know of or um, actually, um, I guess my, my most famous act is is the rapper um, <laughs> Chameleon Air. Excuse me, rapper Chameleon Air. I haven't um, heard of him. I don't no know doubt that. about it, John. No Chameleon. He was 18 years old. Uh, he was in my studio in Chicago. Uh, I had a friend in town, which was a partner. I brought him along, and uh, we knew it'd be special. Um, but at the time, he wanted to get back to Houston and do his thing on the street, and it paid off for him. So, uh, I'm here and it's kind of for a special reason, but you have some new up and comers, a new group you're pretty excited about. Maybe you want to, if you want to share that, that'd be kind of cool. HRC, Hot Rockin' Chicks, coming your way real soon, 2010. And we were just back there, and we probably won't release that footage for a while, but uh, got some good behind the scenes stuff. And uh, that song was pretty hot, man. It's really it was hot. Pretty good. Uh, look got, out, guys. This group might take over this year. So, got a good feeling about this one. So when did you decide this? This is a three-girl group. There's not really anything like that out there. It's kind of cool. Well, and I know this has nothing to do with MMA, but he's an athlete, so that's what we're doing. So just don't even email me or nothing. Well, the deal is, you know, I, I've known all three singers. Uh, they're all been solo. Uh, my idea was to bring something together that's special, um, something that can compete on the highest level. And uh, that's what I feel about all three of these girls. Um, all three of them are very, very talented. They have the ability to go to the next level. Why not put it together and really take it to the next level? And that's my goal. Well, stay tuned. So we're, we're going to be putting together a website here real quick, and then uh, we'll get back and give everyone that reference, and we'll put it right below the video. Uh, check it out. Frank Thomas, good guy. And uh, you, you want to mention the names of the girls in the groups? Well, just remember, W2W Records, HRC, Harmony Moniz, Raquel Halton, Christy George, Hot Rocking Chicks. Come here, Wade, real soon. Perfect. Thanks, man. My pleasure. All right.